Hey, what's going on, everyone? Today is September the 3rd, 2020. We're here to talk about Binance real quick because Binance, you guys can see from this article from Cointelegraph, they're pushing a new stablecoin as it confirms that it's going to end support for their own stablecoin BUSD. Now, there's been a couple of individuals who posted the screenshot from their mobile devices saying that Binance will stop supporting BUSD in 2024. And then you also have Paxos right here said earlier that it will halt support for Binance Stablecoin by February 2024. Now, it took these two things to occur before the actual business of Binance to come out with a statement saying that they are, in fact, going to stop the support of Binance USD, of BUSD. And in fact, they want people to go ahead and utilize another stablecoin called First Digital USD. It was a stablecoin launched in June by the Hong Kong based trust company First Digital Group, which had its debut listing on Binance in late July. What's going on in Binance? Is it in trouble? Is the case that the SEC has against it, Binance, causing it to make some drastic changes in its business structure and what they offer and what they do? You guys can see right now on the chart that I'm looking for Binance to continue to go lower. And this, pro and this news that came from Cointelegraph kind of justifies that yeah the market may continue to go down now this price action right here on the day of the 29th of august kind of resembles that we're still sitting on the right side of the market in binance i.e price is still weak okay even though it did have a small stint to where it ran up i told you all on our video in binance on the 21st of august that as long as the price stays below 230 that the market is still generally weak and that actually occurred right there on the 29th Take a look at Binance real quick here on the five day chart. I wanted to show you all this to also show you that the price action is weak on the five day time frame. Now, it seems to me like the market really hasn't realized how detrimental Binance is or what precarious situation is in right now because the market is not moving swiftly to the downside. Now, I really want the market in Binance to really confirm support right here on the low of June the 15th. If that still happens, you guys can see that's where our ultimate TP price is in Binance, then the market still kind of lives on to stay alive, okay? But off of that article from Cointelegraph, off of Binance any support for their own stable coin, off of the price chart, everything still resembles that the market is still generally weak. Nothing has changed in that regard. So I'm going to continue to keep, go forward with my price prediction, looking for the market at Binance to go down look at my prior videos namely the one on the 21st of august to see my targets uh, because it definitely looked like the market is feasible to go in this direction i'm done that's it wanted to talk about this article real quick uh also give you an update on the price action in binance nothing has changed give me your thoughts those who are new hit that like button today and also subscribe because i give you all the perspective off of the price charts i'm biased off the price chart i see what everyone else is trying to do and if you guys want to learn more and how i do it then I would suggest that you guys follow me. Make sure you maintain your profitability. And as always, trade different.